What is up ladies and gentlemen, CJ the Cheese DJ here and we're back with another 7 days to die video for you guys today and I don't know what's brought all these zombies over here but I'm thinking it could be a source of juicy XP So I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna try and kill them I, don't, I, don't, I got a couple of blunderbusses here, I'm not on full health but I think I'll be okay The only one I'm really worried about is Fat Mama over there I mean, I'm just thinking of the XP here, because we could get a juicy amount of XP from killing these guys. Especially if I can get headshots off like that. I do only have 8 bullets though, so that could be an issue. I don't want to deal with Fat Mama. Not yet anyway. Because she's going to she's gonna take the most to kill, I reckon, so I'll probably save... Ooh, I almost got really close to him. We should probably save the Sledgehammer for her. Yeah, like, this should be a decent source of XP for us. I don't know what they're all doing over there. This, this is, like, this is the most I've seen in one spot, so... Maybe it's because they were headed towards our house. We've got twins here. Double headshot, baby! Let's go! I wonder if we can get these off, uh, the two Stooges as well over here. Hold on, let's, let's line them up. Oh, maybe not. Oh, yeah, hold on. I got one. Okay, let's just keep backing it up here. I've only got three ammo left. I probably should have saved some of this. Okay, this, this, this is the time. This is it. Oh, nice. Nice. Okay, so we got like a fat chunk of XP from that. I don't think there's any searching that can be done. We did get another level. Alright, so... What were we going to grab? I can't remember now. Should grab more sexual Tyrannosaurus, but I feel like we're too... We're still too low. I feel like we should probably get... Yeah, I feel like we should get this. Because now we can... We should be able to make forges. Right? Yeah, see? Alright, cool. So now we can make a forge. Uh, the question is, do I go back and do this now and... Do that and then... I might do that, to be honest, guys. I think we'll do that. How do I get clay? Get clay soil. Okay, I guess we dig. Alright, um, I'm gonna get a forge set up because we're gonna smelt some iron while we, we go out and explore. Because, yeah, we need to just do some exploring and get some more resources and stuff and see what we can find. But I'm glad we just hit the level that we needed in order to make it before we head out. Because I think I've got quite a bit of thingamajig anyway. And I'm pretty sure I can just hit the ground here and that'll give me the soil. Is there anywhere in particular I'm supposed to hit? So that's giving me clay soil. I don't know where I get clay from. Near death experience? I don't know what that achievement's for. Whoa! Okay, so we're getting lots of clay soil here, which is what we need for the forge. But yeah, I don't know how we get clay. My guess is that it's it's got to be like an outcrop like the iron, right? Do I just keep digging down? Does that give me clay? I mean, it would make sense if it does. I'm gonna keep digging down here. I can imagine- oh! I don't want- do I, do I go down here? Okay, I don't want to have to try- <laughs> This could be dangerous, I could bury myself in a hole and get killed by a zombie, so... This probably isn't the smartest idea that I could be doing. Alright, I'm going to see if I can get some clay and I'll bring you guys back in a bit. Can I even get out of here? Okay, cool. At least we can get out. Alrighty, guys. And we have our first forge. Now, I don't know whether or not to make... I mean, I can only make one at the moment. I was going to say, I don't know whether to make one or two. But uh, I think I know how to get clay. So I think we have to fire the clay soil in the forge to get clay. I've also got found a, another node over there. So, yeah, we're just going to keep digging our hole here. I did dig... dig I did deep... I, can I not speak today? I did dig deep. There we go. That Try saying that 10 times bloody fast. Uh, we did dig pretty deep over here. So I'm just going to keep doing some of this clay soil because we might as well while we wait for our forge to keep crafting up because I think we're going to need more clay soil anyway because I think that's how you turn it into clay. I will, we'll find out when we put the forge down. So yeah, but I'm going to get all that up and running. And then I was actually heading over to the trader because I thought I needed to get 
a, a blueprint or something, a schematic. But it seems like I automatically learned it from leveling up. So, yeah, that's great. But we're going to see if we can find another uh, place to... Another place to to take a look at. We're, we're going to head over this way. So, somewhere down here. I don't know what's over there, but we're going to take a look. Starving tourists. Maybe I should go save these guys. I might go save the starving tourists. We just have to go all the way back up there. But I'm hoping that if I can get... There we go, got all that. I'm hoping that if I can get this forge up and running, that I'll be able to bloody make a bike, and then we can actually get around and not have to run around everywhere, because it's super tedious doing it like that. Alrighty guys, so we got the forge up and running, and it looks like it's doing a pretty bang up job. So this is what's coming out of it. So you know what, let's put the rest of that in. I have no idea what I'm doing, but I'm trying to figure it out. So I've got the iron and the clay in there, and that is being melted down, I'm assuming, into the components. And then from there, we can make the forged iron and, and whatever else is in here. So, that's good to know. I'm going to put the rest of this stuff away. We're going to go to the trader. I found some silver nuggets in one of the chests, which, yeah, you can see here. I didn't actually know I had any of those. So, I'm going to put this away, and then we're going to go... And then we're going to go to the trader and see if there's anything that we want. And as well as that, we're also going to... Can I put this on top of the bed? No. As well as that, we're also going to see if she's got anything for sale or any other missions. Um, because, yeah, we need... Well, hold on. Let's... If we go in here for a second, let's check something. Bicycle, right? So we need two wheels. We need a chassis. We need handlebars. And we need mechanical parts. We have the mechanical parts. The chassis... We need forged iron, mechanical parts, duct tape, leather, and two springs. I believe we have all of that. Maybe not the leather. Handlebars, we'd have to make more duct tape. We have many. We have plenty of mechanical parts. I don't think I have any wheels, though. Okay, well, hold on. Let me jerk something. Do I have any repair kits? I have one repair kit. How do I take one? Left click, left click. Okay, so I wanted to just repair my wrench, which it looks like I can now. Because I use the repair kit. Alright, so we can bring that with us as well. That can go away. Alright, so let's... Shies, well, okay, there goes my last uh, shot. That was a mistake. Okay, so that forge is going to keep going for us while we're gone. So we'll head out. Is this just... What does that give me? Okay, so we've got a lead node right out the front of the house too. So we're actually pretty sweet for... For resources, I would say. But yeah, we're going to head over to the trader, see if she's got anything for us, and then we'll see if we can find another point of interest or anything like that. Alrighty, guys. I've also just found this house over here that we haven't actually explored yet. So I might as well take a quick little gander in here and see what we can find. It looks like a fancy, like, lodge where you stay the night. G'day, mate. Goodbye, monsieur. Alright, I think, I think we're good. Is this just another coal? That is coal. Okay, cool. So yeah, I thought we'd come over here and check this place out because it is on the way to the trader. The traders is over here, I'm pretty sure. It does look like there could be a lot of zombies in here, but actually, I, I kind of like the look of this place as well. Maybe we should come move over here. I thought I heard something. Maybe it's just me rustling through the bushes. Can I use this to pick the wheel up? How do I... Okay, that doesn't give me anything. I'm a little nervous going into here, to be honest. Okay, we got a zombie there. I need to have some of these going. Okay, I didn't want to do that. Can I... Thank you. I want to have some of these down just in case. For safety purposes, because they, they help out a lot. Like, just keeping the distance between us. Nice. But I don't think I can pick them up. That's the annoying thing. I can't pick them up for the life of me. We've got some coal here and some charred meat. Alright, let's take all of that. There's... There might be another entrance. I'm going to pick up this potted plant. I'm going to assume there's another entrance, right? There's normally always another entrance. Let's check around back here. Okay, we've got some cars here as well that we can dismember. 
Hello, little bunny rabbit. Don't. Damn it. You move. Oh, you cheeky shit. Come back. I need your hide. Okay, I don't want to waste any more arrows. Yep, look, here's the entrance. Alright. Uh, you know what? We should probably... That was a power attack. There's definitely more zombies in here. I'm going to just grab this cement real quick. I think this is... No, these are the cobblestones. Some glue. Awesome. We need as much glue as we can get. Alright, here's this big... Oh, shit. Bonk. Bonk. Bonks. Alright, this is a... I'm not going to lie. A little bit worrisome. Okay, nice. And... Ouch. We took a hit there, but we were okay. There's more zombies in here, though. This is another destroyed workbench. We're a bit hungry. We'll eat some of that. Uh, I think I... I thought I brought some water with me. Apparently not. Pretty sure there's something behind this. Pretty sure I can hear a zombie planning to murder me. Just gonna keep whacking away. Don't mind me. Oh, hello. We got a medical pile. Some gunpowder, I think that was. Okay, we got. I'm gonna search the workbench here because this should have. Oh, sweet. Another sledgehammer. We'll come back for all this cement. Because, yeah, we're definitely gonna need it. Oh, hello. Hello, ma'am. Oh, God. It's a cheerleader. Back away, just... Yeah, there we go. Alright. Nice. She's dead. I do like the sledgehammers. I think the baseball bat's my favourite so far, though. It just hits really fast, and it's like... Okay, there's more zombies around here. We're just going to do a little bit of searching. Got some clothes there. Chop this down. I think I could probably go under it. Okay, there's a... I think this might be the final room. Ammo here. Okay, I think the zombies are definitely on top of us, though. Oh, it's scary. Alright, so these are tools. Let's see what we got. Another four anvil. That'll be good for when we get uh, another thing. And we got a level six shovel. Granted, it is only a stone shovel, but, you know, that's like... That's like gold to me right now, I think. Alright, we got some more lock picks as well. Oh, there's another box up here. I didn't even see this one. Come on, give me a sledgehammer or something. What do you got for me in here? Another shovel, trigger plate. Uh, another anvil as well. Anvils are always helpful, I guess, if we get more forges, because they increase the speed by like 50%, which is quite a lot. All right, let's 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 keep our wits about ourselves here, because there are definitely zombies in here. I don't know where they are. That's, that's the thing about this. You, you can't tell where they are. I should probably... I'm going to clear out the zombies before I keep looting anything. This is a nice, this is a nice little house though. Not gonna lie, I like the bed up here on the, on the top of the bungalow. All right, she's dead. There's another one over there. Okay, I thought there was one more than one. Nice, nice. All right, he's dead. I should probably utilize power attacks more as well. I think that's all of the zombies. I'm not hearing anything else. Can I get up here? Kind of? Was there any point to me getting up here? No, not really. I don't want to fall off and die. Let's just go back down here. Okay, so now that that's all taken care of, we can actually start looting the place. Now, one thing I, I, I wonder if you guys can answer for me is how do we tell if books have been read or not? Does it... There's another zombie somewhere. Does it come up with like a thingy that... Oh, hello. What is this one? Let's take a look here. Oh, because we've got the durability mod. I mean, I'll t I'll take it and we'll take that as well. We'll come back for the... We'll, we'll switch our helmets over. All right, we got... Oh, first aid kit and steroids. Nice. We'll take all of that. All right, we don't need to worry about any of that stuff. There's still another zombie around here. In the bathroom? Oh, hello! Sorry, ma'am. I did not mean to disturb you. Oh, okay. Get your head blown off in one hit. That's how we roll around here. We got some more of that. This is why we need a bloody bicycle for, because I can't freaking loot anything, because we loot and that's it. We gotta go back to base with freaking one full inventory. Can of dog food. 
Can't be picky in these times. We'll take it and eat it. Did I get murky water? Sweet. We can make some more boiled water with that. Alright. So there's a lot of stuff to loot around here. Um, but yeah. Like, I, I'm trying to figure out how we... It looks like I can use that. No? I'm trying to figure out how we can tell if a book's been read or not. Because... I know you can sell the books to the to the, the merchant, and they sell for quite a lot, but I keep reading books, and I don't know whether or not I've already read them. There's another zombie somewhere. I don't know where it would be. We cleared out all the downstairs, didn't we? Unless we missed a room or something. I'm going to pick up this potted plant. Take it home and make it look nice. Let's take a look here. We just got some paper. Are they outside? Where are these other... Where are these other zombies? Is that everything? Have we looted everything? Have we got a cupboard here. Some more medicine. Empty cupboard. Empty cupboard. There's something behind here. More water. Another cupboard. And I think that's it. Wait, can I search the bathtub? No. Okay, that's it. I'm going to find this last zombie. It's got to be around here somewhere. I don't think there was... We, we got all the loot from in here. A brand spanking new shovel. I'll take it. But yeah, okay, no, hold on. We're going to grab all this uh, cement and stuff. But yeah, we've already, we're already full, right? So like, I don't know... We're going to have to go back to base already. But this is why we need like a, a thingy. Oh, hold on, we got some cupboards in here. This is why we need a, a bike or something for. Because that'll... I'm pretty sure you can use that to store stuff, right? I should probably actually go through and see what I actually should keep. I don't think there's anything else in here. I'm just going to take the rest of this cement. I don't think it's giving us any because we're, we're full. Um, drop that, drop that. I don't need that either. What I want to try is if I grab the wrench, can I use this on this? No, nope. okay. That doesn't work. <laughs> I'm sitting here smacking a tire. Oh, hold on, actually. Let's use this. Okay, we got some parts there. I just need to figure out what we want to drop. Leather duster. Can I wear that? I dropped it. I'll take the duster. I don't know. I don't... I, th I know I need the glue. A splint we can keep. Lock picks, stone spear, you know what, drop the, uh, whatever, drop the spear, drop that. We're actually getting forged iron from this. Okay, cool. Well, I mean, I don't think it has any use because it's destroyed, right? So, this is probably the best fate for it because we get free forged iron from it. We take this trash pile, a little bit of wood. He's got to be just out the front there. He sounds like one of the dangerous ones. Oh, I got ammo. Where did I get blood bus ammo from? Let's load these bad boys up. It's already coming up to bloody night time again. There she is. Hello, miss. Fancy a date with a gun? Boom. You dead. All right. We... Probably need to head back to base because yeah, we just we can't really we can't really do anything. We got oh hold on, we can search these. We don't we don't have any space in our inventories. I can't take the nails. I'm gonna take those and put the sunglasses in there. Now I'm pretty sure if I attack this, we get sap, right? Let's drop that and drop the level three shovel. Pretty sure we're supposed to get we get sap or something or honey from tree stumps. No, apparently not. I just thought that would have given us some stuff because apparently I think you can get honey from it and, and that's supposed to help you heal or something. Alright, um Let's head to the trader before I don't know what that yellow symbol means, but we'll head towards her. Where is she? We'll go this way. Yeah, so we'll head towards the trader. We'll see if we can sell any of this stuff. 
And then we'll see if she, it looks... I think that means she has a mission for us, maybe? I don't know. We'll see when we get there, I guess. We should be able to make it there before she closes. I'm assuming she closes at 10. And then we're going to have to leg it back to the base. Okay, so we got Trader Joe here. We're going to sell all of that for 1100 I don't think we can use it for anything else. Sell all of that. That's some easy money. Oh, we got a bunch of XP for that too. Cool. Cooking grill will keep... Uh, I don't know if we sell anything else, really. Sell price, no sell price. Like, is there... The anvil's probably not worth selling. That's not worth selling. I don't think there's anything really else... I mean, we can sell the puffer coat. Yeah, I don't think there's anything really else worth selling. Um, okay, so let's go over his weapons. He's got a hunting knife here, which I know is like heaps better than the bone knife. Crossbow bolts, rocket frag ammo. That sounds that sounds very dangerous. We've got a chemistry station that we can buy. How much money have we got? 1,636. Tools and traps, clothing. We've got resources, gunpowder, cement, rocks. I kind of want to buy the leather. And the duct tape, to be honest, because I know we're going to need it. Maybe I shouldn't buy all of it. Maybe I should... Okay, let's see what else he, got. he has first. Trigger group, semi-mod, gunpowder, hobo stew. And then this is his special stuff. Bunker Buster mod. 15% more damage against stone. Grand parts for getting an Alexa. An engine, bow and crossbow parts. A rifle? Kind of want a hunting rifle? Pistol Pete. Kinda want a pickaxe. I kinda want the pickaxe because I know it would help, but I don't think we need it because I think we should be alright. I think if anything we get the bunker buster mod. I'm gonna buy the duct tape. I'll buy 10 duct tape because I know it'll be useful. What is it? Oil shale. Into gas. Okay. Uh, other than that, I don't think there's really anything else. Have you got a job for me? Clear zombies. Fetch. Clear zombies. Fetch. Let's go fetch. Friend, it's 500 meters I'm away. In trouble. Would you consider helping me? Brilliant. I guess this is a rally point. All right. So is that... I hope that's near the base, actually. It looks like it might be. Okay, it's up there. Um, we, I don't think we can really do it now because it's night time. We're coming up on the night time. I don't really want to risk going out there. Empty destroyed chemistry station. Can I dismantle this? Surely I can, right? No, it doesn't let me. Okay. I can't destroy that. Vending machine, what? Empty vending machine? Can't do anything with this. I thought, what's the point of an empty vending machine? Oh, it's a rental? Okay, I don't know what that is supposed to do or accomplish. Wait, this fool has a forge the entire time? You tell me this now? Are you kidding me right now? Lock picking success 100%. Do I buy these? I'm gonna... Nerd tags? Can of miso, chicken soup. I'm gonna buy these jailbreakers. How many can I buy? Because there was that vault in that first place that we looked over. And I'm, I'm going to assume that that changes. If that, yeah, if that increases our chance by 100%, that's awesome. Alright, I'm going to head back to base. We need to drop all this stuff off because we're just crazy. And I might, might try and make some, some metal tools and stuff like that. And uh, yeah, I'll bring you guys back in a bit. Oh god, guys, it's a big freaking thingy. We've got two dogs in the house now. One down. Okay, and I've, I've left the door open and we need to go close it. I'm pretty sure I saw two of them. Holy crap, that was so scary, not even gonna lie. That was terrifying. I can't get in through there. I need to put some lights up at the front here. Okay, there's another one there. Absolutely freaking terrifying. All I could hear was the bloody... Just howling. They just spawned. Oh my god. Okay. Things are going alright. We've got... I think 30 forged iron. No, about... 
about a little bit more than 30. We've got about 60 forged iron, which should be enough to make the pickaxe. I am currently looking for that because I'm also going to try and make some wheels as well. I'm just trying to remember what I needed. I wish there was like a grab option like they do, like they have with S plus arc. Because it makes it a little bit easier to be able to find everything. Um, what else did I need? Duct tape. Duct tape. So, and I needed coal. We're going to go... I don't think I can make a... Where do I get a bottle of acid from? Acid? I don't know where I get acid from. I needed to make the wheel. I've got scrap polymers, I've got the oil, i got coal. I don't know if I have acid. I have not seen any acid? Surely it would be, yeah, surely it would be showing up. And I don't think I have any wheels. I can't see any wheels, so I'm assuming that's a no. That kind of sucks. All right, we're so close to making the bicycle. So damn close. We've got another 10 forged iron in there. Okay, let's grab that out. I can put that in the forge as well because we're running low on it. Nice. Okay, so that's going to keep smelting up. So yeah, we've got quite a lot of forged iron, which is great. We've got the pickaxe now. I, I don't really know what else we want to make. Let's just take a quick look through our little... through our list here. I don't think there's anything really else... At the moment, anyway. What about, okay, ammo and weapons. We've got a sledgehammer, blunderbuss ammo. I don't think I want to waste our gunpowder on that just yet. Box of blunt. Okay, sure. Um, okay, here we go. Fire axes. I can make a fire axe. Claw hammer. I don't know what I use the claw hammer for. Iron pickaxe we made. I feel like an iron... I feel like we should just upgrade everything into iron tools. Something very creepy. Uh, yeah, see wheel. I don't know where I get acid from. I have a feeling that I've seen it before. I just don't know. I'm assuming we would get it from like these places where there's like the... All this stuff. So I'll, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll try dismantling the, the washing machine and see if we get the acid from that. Because that's the only place I can think of where we would get it. This wrench is actually, like, such a good thing to have. We're getting a little bit of extra stuff there. Okay, I don't think we get acid from here. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. I was hoping we'd be able to get a bicycle up today. But it doesn't look like that's going to be the case. Because, yeah, we, we just need that acid to get the wheels. And I don't think we can get wheels... ...from from dismantling the cars, either. I don't think. So, I don't know where else we can get, for, get them from. But, I mean, we've got some extra stuff here, I guess. So, that's helpful. Alrighty, guys. So, I spent most of the night just... Pretty much mining up some more iron and uh, clay soil. Because I figured, well, we're always probably going to need forged iron and stuff. So, what I might do as well, is because I've got extra, I might actually just... Oh, I can't upgrade it. Do I need like a metal door or something? Metal furniture? Is there a metal door? No. Okay, so what do I need to upgrade that? I don't know what that is. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Okay. Uh, so we can't do that. That's fine. But uh, yeah, I thought we were going to have the mini bike by now. I apologize that we haven't gotten it. I know. Pathetic of me. We just need that bottle of acid is pretty much the only thing stopping us from getting it. So I need to try and see if we can find out where to get some acid from. Wait, hold on. Can I dismantle this as well? I don't need you anymore, barbecue. I thank you for the efforts you provided us by being here, but... You no longer need it. I probably didn't need to use my wrench for that, but that's fine. So, yeah, I've got to try and figure out where we can get acid from, but we'll probably put the bike on hold, to be honest, mainly because we have Horde Night, I'm assuming, coming up. 
So we're, we're going to need to really get on top of that and make sure that that's all up and running because we don't want to be at this base when they come for us. I don't think we'd probably want to build like a, a little thingy out of cobblestone because we should have heaps of cobblestone, I think. If not, that's definitely what we need to go looking for. But uh, nonetheless, guys, that's going to wrap the episode up here today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe down below for more, and I'll catch you in the next one.